So we're just gonna continue this ACV man. We gotta meet Stow and Erke. Whatever his name is. Up in here. We get up in there. It's so we can show out of here. Oh, on them. On them is tricking on me. Hell yeah, chill, yeah. Let me in, let me in, man. Some surly guests outside. Hey, but we were, uh, we, we didn't see you enter. Oh, uh, which one was talking? Hey. It is about time you found each other. Stop tiptoeing around it. Yes. I've found Stowe and he's found me. And, uh, and here we are, together. Have you stepped out today? There's oh, a strange feeling brewing in the streets. I've heard the shouts. The deaths of Avgos and Frieswith have angered many. Let us hope the compass numbers among the offended. I don't doubt it, but be ready for him. Let us go over all that has happened up till now. Trigger was killed and dismembered by men who worked for him. Men he trusted. Avgos, the Arrow. Our brother in arms. He wanted Lyndon for the Order. And the good sister. That's another knife to the back. London Saint. Sister Frieswith. She was the leech and the city was her meat market. Your bishop has already issued an apology on behalf of the church. It is time we focused on the compass. Gather all we know and lay it out, plain as day. I Surely. We let fly the feather dart, cut raven ink from a cowering quill. Now we wait, wolf tensed, for the master of the river rip to return and revenge his shaken warriors. Well, well, this one's got the gift of all in's meat. What is on your mind, Stowe? We know the compass is a sailor, a captain from Francia. And he won't like hearing he's got a leak in his hull, so to speak. With the death of the leech and the arrow, you want to hit back. But we can't know how or when. Apart from this, the man's invisible. Coward, if you ask me. Burn in your hell, you bloody reeves! We're pinned in! Is there another way out? The tower! There's an open window <laughs> they can't have reached! I'll go up! You find a way out! They scheming me though. Look at him. Stuck in his teapot, bro. What the front door? Oh my gosh, this is loud, bro. Let's turn this down. What? I jump over here? I guess not. Um. Cape St. Paul. Jump right there. Oh. The slide. I need it's my my face right quick, man. That boy stuck in his T pose or something. I don't know. Oh shoot. Um it above, but I ain't seen the maybe all the way up there. Two boys is just standing in there. the doors he still ah, me boy
Look at him, he's stuck in his T-Pose. He can't do nothing. He updated this game or something. Boy, he's stuck, stuck. Look at him. Boy, moonwalking without moonwalking, bro. Look at that. He's gliding, bro. The fuck? Better be face here, though. I had a view Who's of the that? city from the roof. There's a new flotilla in the harbor. The compass, bastard. If we commandeered the springles that have got built, we could rain a cloud of arrows on the invaders. I'd sooner take the flank and go around this army to the boats. If we cut the head off this beast, the order's men will be easy to rout. Let us focus on the compass. Kill him and the battle's won. I can lead you straight to him. Through the reeds, like Stowe's Moses. Whatever happens, this ends tonight. May God guide our swords and cover our backs. May God please fix this bug right here. I'll see you when it's done, Edge King. Count on it. This is. Follow me. I know the path straight to the docks. <laughs> we'll be able to fight. Hi, bro. Really. Oh my goodness. What is this all about, bro? Are you okay? He's oh shoot. He's not okay, bro. He's glitching now, bro. Oh, just run. Just run, my boy. This dude chasing me. Where's he at, though? Where's he? You take, find, and assassinate. Wait, what? Let's see. Hey, oh my goodness. <laughs> Where is this him? Chicken? Oh my goodness. What is going on here? I gotta help him. I guess it wasn't right there. So, oh my gosh, this guy is crazy. Oh Please tell me that fix now. Oh, it did not. He's still tweaking, bro. <laughs> still tweaking. Are you good now? No, he's not. Taking that post for him. Are you as deep? Deep. Got like dive and stuff. Maybe not. Hey, you can, man. I like this bow at all. Too zoomed in. Let's push. Oh no! He said shorty. Shoot in the back. Yeah, that got me in. Oh, my boy. Large enough to ford an ocean. I'll drown Temple. Go and take his last You stupid Sankia. Oh, my goodness. We're getting smacked up, and I'm not even using. Oh, I didn't mean to dodge. Smacked up. Hey, brother. Sorry, bro. You, you not, you not the guy, bro. Not the guy, bro. You not the guy, bro. You do this right quick. Okay. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Confirm it. Confirm it. Burning to ash what you cannot possess, that is a child's way out. 
To hell with London. Boudicca was right to burn it to the ground. It's a brick and mortar shit house. So bright and beautiful set of flame. Will you rule over these cinders now? Yoke its people to your whims and needs? You do have power here. Power you have earned. I have finished my work in London. That is enough. <laughs> London is only a beginning. My order reaches further than your tiny boats can take you. Never forget, Trigger, my old friend. A man at sea may have gold and glory. But he is always a slave to the churning tides. We are that tide. Please tell me my boy Eric, whatever his name is, is done. Please. Please tell me. Or dead though. Better just walk over there. Nobody's playing with me. It's you. Nobody playing with me. There you are. The drinker we must thank for our good fortune. Look, he's back to normal. How do I look? Half drowned and half burnt? Not half of either. And far better for the blood on your blade. The compass is dead. London is yours to wreck or rebuild. We will rebuild. We'll strengthen the walls, reunite families, and likely use less wood, more stone. <laughs> Ill-timed, Erke. I'd like a quiet moment to pray. We'll take it together. Until our next meeting, I trust you will heed my call if I should send for you. You came to London in search of a friend, Eivor. You found two. Aye, Broga. And you deserve this. A silver ring for your raven perch. It was Trigger's before he gifted it to me. I say you've earned the rights to wear it now. I'm touched, Erke. I will carry it with pride. Like they scheming, bro. His name's Erke, though. Good, Ava. What did I get, though? What did What did I? What did I get? For how you say it? Use my skill points. Right down here. You. Be using range. That's the thing. Be going over here. Damage. Get some new. No, I did not. Um. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Rantvi. Yeah, let's go back. Let's tell her the good news. Go back to our shorty. Shorty. My love. London is with us and cleansed of the order. Good. Hytham will be pleased. You better stop calling me that, bro. I should speak with Hytham. Hey, why? Bro, Hytham? Who are you? Who's going? Hmm. Alright, let's go speak to the high thumb. Wrong way. Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. My bad, my bad. 
I should talk to Hytham about my next targets. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. The Order has been purged from London. For now, they hold no power there. That is good news. And I would celebrate, but for the fact that Jorvik now suffers from the same infestation. Jorvik is a city under Norse control. I should have less problems finding allies there. That is a hopeful way of seeing it. Speak to Ranvi when you wish to travel there. I have something here for you. Tidings that may displease you. Tell me. You remember Kjotve's son, Gorm? He has since taken his father's place in the Order. Interesting. He's got him here in England. Is he another blotch on our list? He is one of our targets, yes. But he is not in England. He is further west, in fact. A land called Vinland, discovered centuries ago by an Irish sailor called Brendan. The Order of the Ancients has some recent fascination with Vinland, but I cannot say what it might be. Let me find out for you. After I silence got him. Vinland is far away, according to my source. It may take weeks to find him after a long and perilous journey. There's no danger that would cow me, Hytham. I will speak with Ranvi and arrange passage. Was there something else? Sure, I even had it. I have to go. Then go in peace. Go. Um. <coughs> oh, Vinland. This one's 60, though. I think there's one still um needs to be a uh, ally with. I'm about to go check. Like scissors or something. Can I have a companion one? Like Skyrim or something? Birna, welcome to the Raven Clan's nest. Good to be here, Sumbi. The people here seem a mixed bag of nuts and seeds. I feel right at home. You are at home. Settle in and get a feel for the place. We will be heading out soon enough. Of course. A quick drink and a friendly brawl, and I will be ready for the raids ahead. Jesus. Just having me raiding. <laughs> My goodness. I want to see the Alliance map. Have you spoke with Hytham about Vinland? I have. Good. I have marked it on the map with a bit of guesswork as to its location. Let me know when you wish to leave. I don't want to do Vinland yet. Vinland. Perfect. Perfect. One sixty. I'm the doing this first. Has traveled to Sherapsha. He has, into a difficult situation. The Shire has been mired in a long war with Rodri, King of the Britons. Sheolbert hopes to negotiate a peace with the Britons of the West. A difficult task for one so green. I hope your tutelage has prepared him well. Indeed. But I think it best if you supervise these talks. If Sheolbert can make this work, we will gain a valuable alliance. Shit. That was a hard ship. I will make my way to Shropshire. Shropshire. He and Ivar should be in Quatford just now. You will find it along the F and Hafun River. If Ivar is with him, I will certainly be needed. Let me go here. To do this stuff first. What do, what do in here? What? What are you doing here? See, she said you locked her in here. I didn't lock her. She told me. Oh, wow. Aid me. Be my eyes. <laughs> what is this boy? Celebrate. <laughs> Not half bad, boy. But be fierce, dirty. Strike at my ball. Ivar, 
Are you training the boy, or tormenting him? One will lead to the other in time. Eivor, well met. You received my message, and just in time. Our negotiations with the Britons have not yet begun. I will be at your side when they do. Is there anything I should know first? The venerable King Rodri is here. I am to deal with him directly. Rodri is desperate for peace. Ever since we captured his sniveling brother, Goriad. Sounds like a man coughing up snot. Goriad ap Mervin. Rodri waits at the church nearby. Who speaks for Shirapshire in these talks? The last elderman was killed in battle. Bishop Deolav is standing in. Until we get this wet whelp installed. That is his father's wish. I find the idea of leading a shire on my own quite... quite terrifying. It is a grave thing to be elderman in the time of war, Gelbert. He will piss his pants first thing, that's for certain. As future elderman, you should speak in the talks as well. But with humility. <laughs> Rodri is the king, and will expect to be treated as one. Rodri will want us to get down on our knees and snip the rosy wind blowing from his ass. I know the man. You've met him? Met him, fought him. He gave me this nick here. Maybe I can give him one back. Remind him some call me King Killer. It may be you should stay behind, Ivar. That is not a recipe for a good parley. I'd like you both to be there. To guide me, to judge my fitness. Give us your word, then. Your blade stays in its sheath. Eivor, don't make me laugh. We both know what my word is worth. But sure, I will let you do the talking. Probably. Excellent. Now, to the church, I think. Our guests await. Look at dragons. The mountain. Far, just across the village. We've been at war with the Britons for coming on two years. The Britons had the best of it. Tell me and my berserkers plowed through their ranks and chased Rodri's brother into a ditch. That's why Rodri's talking peace now. It's thanks to Eva. I am going to enjoy seeing him squeal, the old oak. Not nearly as much as taking him down, though. That would seal my legacy. Your legacy? As king killer. They do not all get away like Borgred did, Wolfkist. Keep the peace, Eva. What has become of your preening brother? Oh, my brother. We parted. This road is unsure. You are better off leaving that sauntering pole in your way. That's my brother. Don't play with him. I just left his wife. Our Bishop Dalev and King Rodri are ensconced in the church ahead. These houses of Christ, they are all so hard and cold. Yet within his walls, the Christian God unites King Rodri, Bishop Dalev, and myself. Hmm. On his ground, yeah, dog horses. Made. Come on, brother. You can't take me. I cannot take my boy Avery. Sorry. Captain O'Neill, explain to the good bishop our position. Yes, my sovereign. Bishop Dearlove. We are deaf to offers of peace until Guriad hit the king's brother. <laughs> the king's brother is a moldering sack of cow dung. You. I know your face, your stench. Ivar, the one they call Boneless. Did I not gift you that scar myself? Ah, you did. And I mean to gift you a gash, you reeking piss pot in your fat fucking skull. Hold, both of you. My lord, this is Jailbelt, the future elderman of this shire and the son of King Chailwolf of Mercia. This green stripling? Elderman? You can piss without help, boy. Now, now, calm everyone. Good faith is all I ask. You know my demands. Until my brother Gwiriad walks free, peace between us is impossible. He is lucky he can walk at all. 
fell on his own blade, fleeing from us. I will soon help you fall on yours. Husband, keep your head. It is in our interest to find a way to peace, all of us. First, my brother. First, your head on a pike. Then the runt goes free. Husband, no! Enough! This is a house of God. Let us take some few minutes to gather ourselves, shall we? Eivor, to me. I do not know you well, but Chaelbert believes you a steady head. We need such a one. It may be too late. I see the crows of war gathering. I have a hefty sum of silver. Speak to the people here. If the silver will help one bring us toward peace, offer it to them. Take that silver from my pocket, bro. What are you talking about? Dang, that's actually a lot. Wait, who? I who gets silver. King. King Rodri. What is it, Dane? I wish to help you to peace. I will not talk of peace until my brother Gwyriant is returned to me. If you first agree to peace, he will be returned. Would a sum of silver help overleap this difficulty? I cannot be purchased with looted silver, Dane. Stand away. If you don't want the silver, I'll take it. Talk, talk, talk. All we do is talk. Do not fret. You will be older than yet. Pause. Have you made progress? The giving of silver is more difficult than I imagined. You are with Rodri, yes? One of his advisors. I am that. Anir Ab Kadvarch by name. Address me proper. Tell me, um, soldier. Do you hold sway with your king? <laughs> he consults me for his every decision. If I push for war, he will agree. If I argue for peace, he will follow. Peace is our desired end. Is there a chance that some silver might lead you to counsel your king in the same direction? A sack of silver? For me? Yes, I might amend my advice to Rodri for a tidy sum of shining metal. Yes. You are a wise warrior. Perhaps the silver will come available. <laughs> and you, go and take a shit and let me know how it turns out. We should settle this with blood, not pretty words. Well, you? Eivor, mm. my friend. I asked around, as you suggested. Ask you to do. a decision. To whom have you given this silver? <laughs> I have yet to make I... my decision. Please, don't tarry. I'm, I'm a good, good person. Lady, Lady, let us get past the anger and find our way to an agreement. What is your husband's greatest concern? The royal treasury has been depleted by the war. This brings immense strain to Rodri and his every decision. If I could provide a boon of silver, would that guide your husband away from war? A replenished treasury would certainly help my husband come to peace. If such a boon comes, I will consider your words. <laughs> ah, enough of this nonsense! Hey. <laughs> Why my boy just started running like that? Um... I have to read that. Um, who's you? You are Guriat, are you not? Brother to King Rodri. So I am. And a bruised pawn in your bloody game. How do you stand with your brother? My brother loves me well. Yet he can be slow and stubborn. But I, King, I'd have played all this quite differently. What if you had the chance? At the crown, I would leap at the chance to rule. But a man needs wealth to bring down a king. Nobles must be bought, you understand. I make no promises, but I may be able to find you the silver you need. Under what terms? Knock Rodri from his throne. Withdraw all Briton soldiers from Shropshire, and never again threaten this border. If you speak true, I would make that bargain gladly. <sighs> I will see about the silver. I really don't know, man. I might give it to the wifey. Protect the boy. 
Lock the doors, murder that sweating pig, and have done with it. If I could find you silver, would that quell your bitterness while we seek peace? Peace? Is that what you think is going to happen here? I told you, I know this bastard. Will silver quiet you? It may, it may not. I would have to see the silver in my hands to know for sure. If there is no, no, any no. silver to be had, I will think about it. You do that. Hey, let me... Now you dangle silver before me. Are you so frightened of the Britons that you fight your battles with wealth? We um summarize the advisor. He's she's the wifey. I want to. I don't want to save. I'm not gonna save. I'm just give it to him. Guriat, we in yes. to buy me a throne. What say you? I want to be actually. I I'm interesting though, man. We're gonna go murder the king or something. Okay. Dear lady, the treasure you spoke of would help bring us to peace. I'm gonna do this. I'm sorry. Might be. Take this silver. Do what you can to calm your husband. I shall. The kingdom of Gwyneth thanks you. I have spoken with everyone who matters. Eivor, my friend. I spoke with more people. Have you made a decision at last? Ivar is increasingly agitated. Lady Young Harad will use the silver to bolster the royal treasury. That will reassure and calm Rodri. Ah, a wise woman indeed. Rodri, I see you mocking me! I challenge you! Single Ivar, combat no. now! Boneless Ivar. Spineless, toothless, gutless. You cannot kill me. A dragon will be my death, as my seers have foretold. And your brother. Does your destiny guard him? Guriad! <laughs> By God Almighty, I'll... Get him to safety. Go, quickly. Kill the boneless one. Paint this chapel with his blood. Oh my gosh, maybe I should have gave him the money. Shiva! What have you done? Because I asked too much people. See, we get mad every time I ask somebody new. Why just smack me down? Vibrant in here. Turn it down. Okay, maybe I gave it to Ivar. It's all good though. Ah, now that is Viking Earth diplomacy. Show the fuckers who the real warriors are. Ah. You have scuppered the peace. Do not be fooled by peace, boy. It is just an empty voice between axe blows. Dear Lord, this is a massacre. We have no choice now but to fight our way out of this. Ah, a good test for you, boy. Lord, forgive us. Stay close, Chelbert. You watch my back and I will pull the knives from yours. Dear Lord. Stay here, where it's safest, Bishop. This fucking door. Yeah, bro. Let's go, though. Hey, come here a moment. Should have gave it to Evo. I'm sorry, brother. Living a big wide out. Good defense. But he can't be playing with Avor. All I know.
Oh, there's two bullies there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I've done him while he was up. There we go. That my boy, Gilbert. This is your mistake. Ain't my mistake. Probably, but I'll give it to the lady. That's a Macy's man. Four. <clears throat> hey, what? Would it have stopped this war from happening? Don't know. My game getting chopped. Too much people here. Gotta kill these green guys. Oh my gosh, she killed my blue brother. It's making me up though. Of them. Why is this boy not looking at me, man? Way no way, boy. boy. Ain't no way. With my XP. My XP, though. Need my 5 XP per kill. Way no way, boy. <laughs> Big boy. Way, or oh, yes, way, boy. Go talk to him. Ain't a way, boy. Well, ain't no way, boy. We celebrating already. Crazy. <laughs> why he start? Why he start running from me, though? <laughs> you murdered Rodri's brother, you beast! Our one chance at peace is lost. Peace with Rodri is as likely as you dying a virgin, Bishop. It won't happen. He is too canny, too vile. What's done is done. We must plan our next moves before the Britons regroup. They will retreat to their great castle for certain. It's well nigh impregnable. Then we starve them out. Attack their supplies. Watch them beg for death. Dear God. More death, more war, endless refugees. This is our only way forward, dear love. You know the territory best. How can we hurt them? Well, 
For food and supplies, they stockpile cargo at Wenlakan outpost, down south of Quatford. Rodri has another secret supply line. Ask among the refugees near the river, those who have fled from occupied villages. Rodri's Britons will strike back long before we can. Indeed. They will send Anir and his soldiers. They train in Wesbury, west of the ruined tower. You do not need me to hold your hand, Eivor. I will head to Wesbury, scout around. I know your method of scouting. It always leads to swordplay. I am as regular as Tidewater. I shall go with you, if only to get an honest accounting of our situation. I will meet you both at Westbury, then, once I've done some damage. Until then... Good day. One last thing. We'll need a field before our battle's done. Try to free any captives you find. They'll swell our ranks. Why in a way, boy? Don't tell me it's like... The last quest, bro. In a way. Oh, in a way, boy. I'm to use my skills, though. I'm almost there. This guy. Who's this? First shot. Uh, Get chipping on it. Um. Alright, YouTube, I'm finna end the video right here, you feel me? Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that. Turn on the bell notification so you don't miss another video. And you know, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'll see y'all in the next one.